A meteoroid is a small rocky or metallic body in outer space. Meteoroids are significantly smaller than asteroids, and range in size from small grains to one meter wide objects. Objects smaller than this are classified as micrometeoroids or space dust. Most are fragments from comets or asteroids, whereas others are collision impact debris ejected from bodies such as the Moon or Mars. When a meteoroid, comet, or asteroid enters Earth's atmosphere at a speed typically in excess of 20 km per second, 72,000 km per hour, 45,000 miles per hour, aerodynamic heating of that object produces a streak of light, both from the glowing object and the trail of glowing particles that it leaves in its wake. This phenomenon is called a meteor or shooting star. Meteors typically become visible when they are about 100 km above sea level. A series of many meteors appearing seconds or minutes apart and appearing to originate from the same fixed point in the sky is called a meteor shower. A meteorite is the remains of a meteoroid that has survived the ablation of its surface material during its passage through the atmosphere as a meteor and has impacted the ground. An estimated 25 million meteoroids, micrometeoroids and other space debris enter Earth's atmosphere each day, which results in an estimated 15,000 tons of that material entering the atmosphere each year. In 1961, the International Astronomical Union, IAU, defined a meteoroid as a solid object moving in interplanetary space, of a size considerably smaller than an asteroid and considerably larger than an atom. In 1995, Beach and Steele, writing in the Quarterly Journal of the Royal Astronomical Society, proposed a new definition where a meteoroid would be between 100 micrometers and 10 meters, 33 feet, across. In 2010, following the discovery of asteroids below 10 meters in size, Rubin and Grossman proposed a revision of the previous definition of meteoroid to objects between 10 micrometers and 1 meter, 3 feet 3 in, in diameter in order to maintain the distinction. According to Rubin and Grossman, the minimum size of an asteroid is given by what can be discovered from Earth-bound telescopes, so the distinction between meteoroid and asteroid is fuzzy. Some of the smallest asteroids discovered, based on absolute magnitude h, or 2008 TS26 with H equals 33.2 and 2011 CQ1 with H equals 32.1 both with an estimated size of 1 meter, 3 feet 3 in. In April 2017, the IAU adopted an official revision of its definition, limiting size to between 30 micrometers and 1 meter in diameter, but allowing for a deviation for any object causing a meteor. Objects smaller than meteoroids are classified as micrometeoroids and interplanetary dust. The Minor Planet Center does not use the term meteoroid. Almost all meteoroids contain extraterrestrial nickel and iron. They have three main classifications, iron, stone, and stony iron. Some stone meteoroids contain grain-like inclusions known as chondrules and are called chondrites. Stony meteoroids without these features are called achondrites, which are typically formed from extraterrestrial igneous activity. They contain little or no extraterrestrial iron. The composition of meteoroids can be inferred as they pass through Earth's atmosphere from their trajectories and the light spectra of the resulting meteor. Their effects on radio signals also give information, especially useful for daytime meteors, which are otherwise very difficult to observe. From these trajectory measurements, meteoroids have been found to have many different orbits, some clustering in streams, see meteor showers, often associated with apparent comet, others apparently sporadic. Debris from meteoroid streams may eventually be scattered into other orbits. The light spectra, combined with trajectory and light curve measurements, have yielded various compositions and densities, ranging from fragile snowball-like objects with density about a quarter that of ice, to nickel-iron-rich dense rocks. The study of meteorites also gives insights into the composition of non-ephemeral meteoroids. Most meteoroids come from the asteroid belt, having been perturbed by the gravitational influences of planets, but others are particles from comets, giving rise to meteor showers. Some meteoroids are fragments from bodies such as Mars or our Moon, that have been thrown into space by an impact. Meteoroids travel around the Sun in a variety of orbits and at various velocities. The fastest move at about 42 km per second, 94,000 miles per hour, through space in the vicinity of Earth's orbit. This is escape velocity from the Sun, equal to the square root of 2 times Earth's speed, and is the upper speed limit of objects in the vicinity of Earth, unless they come from interstellar space. Earth travels at about 29.6 km per second, 66,000 miles per hour. So when meteoroids meet the atmosphere head-on, which only occurs when meteors are in a retrograde orbit such as the Eta Aquariids, which are associated with the retrograde Halley's Comet, 
the combined speed may reach about 71 km per second, 160,000 miles per hour. See specific energy hashtag astrodynamics. Meteoroids moving through Earth's orbital space average about 20 km per second, 45,000 miles per hour. On January 17, 2013 at 521 Pacific Standard Time, a one-meter-sized comet from the Oort cloud entered Earth atmosphere over California and Nevada. The object had a retrograde orbit with perihelion at 0.98 plus or minus 0.03 astronomical units. It approached from the direction of the constellation Virgo, which was in the south about 50 degrees above the horizon at the time, and collided head-on with Earth's atmosphere at 72 plus or minus 6 kilometers per second, 161,000 plus or minus 13,000 miles per hour, vaporizing more than 100 kilometers, 330,000 feet, above ground over a period of several seconds. When meteoroids intersect with Earth's atmosphere at night, they are likely to become visible as meteors. If meteoroids survive the entry through the atmosphere and reach Earth's surface, they are called meteorites. Meteorites are transformed in structure and chemistry by the heat of entry and force of impact. A noted 4-meter, 13-feet, asteroid, 2008 TC3, was observed in space on a collision course with Earth on 6 October 2008 and entered Earth's atmosphere the next day, striking a remote area of northern Sudan. It was the first time that a meteoroid had been observed in space and tracked prior to impacting Earth. NASA has produced a map showing the most notable asteroid collisions with Earth in its atmosphere from 1994 to 2013 from data gathered by U.S. government sensors.